guys, welcome to the very first edition of Unlock the Box, the monthly series where uh, myself, my mother, and my husband try every item in this month's Keto Box. Don't forget, if you want your own Keto Box, you can use the code WATCHAUTUMNKETO for 20% off your first box, or you could stick around to the end of this video and see if you're going to be the winner of your very own Keto Box. So uh, this will be very similar to the Smash the Crate videos where we just try all the snacks and let you know what we think just as a review of our four tier system. Yes. Also a review for Richard as well. Yes, okay, know. we have four tiers and think of it as this, first place, second place, third place, fourth place, okay? Yes, tier one is the best. That means, whoa, I love this. I'd pay my own money to have this product again. That's mm -hmm. the highest compliment you can give something yes. is buying it, right? Tier number two is, you know what? That was pretty good. And if someone gave that to me or I got it at a meetup or like I just came across yeah. it, I would definitely enjoy that. That was Makes good. Sense. Yeah, I wouldn't necessarily buy it, but I wouldn't turn it away. Mm -hmm. Tier number three is like, eh, if someone gave it to me, I'd keep it. Yeah. Because don't really yeah like don't really know if it's the first thing i would grab but it's it's you know like break glass in case of emergency it's like okay at least it's I there like the you know and then tier number four is actively spit it out of your mouth i will not eat this even if someone gave it to me for free i would refuse it because yes. i don't like it right so we're just going to try all of the products in this month's keto box and we're going to rate them on our tier system all right. starting with here we go. Country Archer Beef Stick. Getting that out of the way, because we all know how I feel about a beef stick. Mm. Are you trying it? Yeah, I'm going to try it. I think they're really regular. I mean, do you want to try it? That's fine, yes. That's what we do. Well, I'm definitely okay, I know. Try I know Richard's going to want to try it. Gonna send it over this way. I'll be a one man trying. Yeah. Exactly. I'm just going to. So our tries can be a little smaller. Yeah, little tries. baby tries. Mm -hmm. And then I'll take a chunk <laughs> off the log. And then this is. <laughs> I don't like chunk off the log. I don't like that. Okay, this is the original flavor. Mm -hmm. Original beef stick. Mm -hmm. Country like beef Archer. Stick. Tastes like a beef stick. Yeah. Never need to have one of those ever again in my entire life and I'd be okay. Yes, yeah, so if mm -hmm. you want meat and you're stuck in the middle of nowhere... Why do we always have to be destitute when it, like before we can like get a snack, you know? Because if we're best. out in the middle of nowhere, at least I have my beef stick. Like, if what is that? If, you, if you're living your life, yeah, mm -hmm. just walking about the world. No. We need a guide because we exactly. all hiking, yeah, you're all, you need you're, you get lost so long that like you need lots of food. And a beef so. stick. No, mm -mm. no. Oh, okay, that's... for me, that's a tier three. Like. If I am desperate for snackage, I will grab a meat stick. But that that has nothing to do with the quality of the meat stick. If you like meat sticks, you're gonna like that. That's just my personal preference. I'm giving a two minus. I mean, I know, but I mean, so did we say there was room for you? partial, you know, tears here? I will three. also go two. Yes. Okay. Not bad. Yes. Not bad at yes. all. Me loves meat sticks. Me love uh -huh. meat sticks. Okay, the next thing we're gonna try are these Field Trip Crispy Cuts. Mm. These are pork rinds. The flavor is Parmesan Ooh. peppercorn. Yes. I'm pretty sure I've had these before, and I'm pretty sure I like them. Let, let's well, see. Oh, uh, God. Exactly. Yeah. Parmesan it's peppercorn. Clearly, like it's not about me. Things. Okay. Okay. I mean, oh, really, really bag ripper. I ruined this bag. Sure? I'm so uh, sorry, I bag. Like I'm sorry, nearby. everyone. No. I do have scissors yeah, nearby. My bad. Seriously. My bad. Oh, Jeez. handful. Well, I mean, mm, in no. case they you, are you grab the delicious handful. as they sound. No. They, I don't have they honestly, they honestly smell like like, like Parmesan. Like do? I can. Okay, let's go. Okay. Hmm. Okay. It tastes good, but I don't know. What I it smell is. the Parmesan. I taste the peppercorn. Okay. Like you can also see, you can see the pepper flakes on this, and you can taste it. I mean, I give it a two. That's not bad. Yeah. I definitely give it a tier two. If somebody gave these to me, like, mm -hmm. these would be great with taco tray. I'll say that. Yeah, I've yeah. never smelled a bad pork rind. I know, right? I mean, like, the, you know. I smell the Parmesan. I don't taste it. Yeah, I don't really taste it. But I do taste the pepper. I don't even taste that. Mm -hmm. But it taste just tastes pepper. like a nice pork rind. Tastes like a good... Mm -hmm. Evenly flavored pork yes. rinds. Next, we are going to try these Mabuno Harvest Dried Organic oh, Coconut. Oh, sounds sweet, mm. man. Okay. So, there is nothing in this uh, besides dried coconut. So, oh, it's just going to taste like so dried coconut. Yeah, like, well, I would have, 
I wouldn't have minded if, if it was like coated in a sweetener yeah. or something, but no, apparently it's so, just coconut. Ingredients, coconut. No, yeah, literally ingredients, organic dried coconut. That's it. Like, wow. Yeah, exactly. Right. So if you like the taste, ooh, it has the little rinds on it, which ooh. I'm here for. Oh, Jeez wow. Louise, these are long strips. Wow. You might as well just grab one. Let's take one because I don't know how much I trust this. The, how much you like organic dry mm -hmm. coconut? Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. like you can see there are long flakes like and chips. Chip. Thanks, yeah, like Mom. Potato Richard chip. did that. I know, yeah. I'll pay huh? attention. Okay, let's try it. Mmm. Oh, crunchy. Mmm. I mean, tastes like coconut, and I like coconut. I would definitely like for it to be sweet. Er? No, we are. I can taste it. But the flavor of the coconut is good. Mm. I do like it being in the larger flake form versus the shreds that we normally get. So that's a fun way to eat it. Yeah, but it sure is. That's an interesting. I'm, I've never had that before. Mm. See, Richard's not doing it. Oh, sorry. I'm still chewing. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot. Yeah. yeah, it's a lot. It is. I mean, I have been, but it's Honestly, still stuff like It is quite the, toothsome. The, the, the chef in me will say three, mm -hmm. but the me in me says tier four. Oh, really? Like, wow. It's just bad. I would have spit it out like seconds ago, but really? I'm going to suffer through it. <laughs> You're going to chew it? You don't like the flavor like, that much? It doesn't taste like anything. It tastes it like tastes coconut, though. No. Like dry, I mean, coconut it is thrown in the dirt and, and put sand on it. It is, it's like sandy yeah. coconut. I yes. will say that. Oh, yes, that's amazing. So, this is the Adonis Keto Nut Bar Pecan Cocoa and Goji Berry. Your face. Okay, so I've never had this bar before. I know for a fact it is, looks it looks decent. Yeah, it actually, it I is. like it's, it's like it soft. Okay. Yeah, so here you can take that yeah. piece. Mm hmm. Yeah, I definitely. Oh. I definitely mm. like what what sort of nut is this? Pecan, cocoa, and goji berry. Okay. I like the chewy texture. No. I can definitely taste the pecans. It's almost like a no mm -hmm. big cookie kind of vibe. Honestly, I don't really get any chocolate, like the cocoa, and I definitely don't get no goji berry, which once again, if I, I don't got mind a goji that. Goji berry, I wouldn't even want it. Yeah. It so the like ingredients raisins. are pecans, coconut, hazelnuts, and then chicory root fiber, a bunch of stuff, and then we're, I was like the very last ingredient is goji berry, like so barely goji barely. Mm -hmm. You know what yeah. I'm saying? To me, this is a tier three, yeah. like definitely something I would keep in the drawer, but I definitely like go for a quest bar over this. Oh, yes. I'd go for a lot of other bars before I went for this one. But that being said, they don't taste bad. No, so, right, that's yeah. the same taste. I'll do the yeah. three as well. I would say three. Also. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, next we have the Ooh. cookie department in my palette for this. Cakewalk. Okay. <sighs> I was not very impressed with this cookie the last time I had it, but maybe I will be more impressed this time. Oh, is this one we were looking so forward to trying? And then mm -hmm. it's like, wah, wah. Yeah, I think you will be very familiar with it when we take a look at it and we see the front of it. And we see those sad oh. blue sprinkles. Okay, let's see if I it tastes better. I prefer a soft over a hard cookie. Mm -hmm. I don't want too much crunch. It tastes more like a cake though than a cookie. Mm -hmm. It is birthday cake. Mm. Well, it's a small round birthday cake now. Mm. I mean, it's not horrible. It's a three again. I mean, it's a good. Maybe maybe it's a two minus. Mm, so the it's flavor is okay. Yes. It does have like a vanilla like a cakey mm -hmm. flavor it's a solid two for me yeah it's wow. not i don't know anytime i hear I cake I, like I just want icing i give it a three i guess because there are other cookies that i would grab in front of this but this isn't a bad tasting yeah, cookie right. I this enjoyed one's it. it's minus. soft it's really chewy i do feel like it has a heavy almond flour taste and like kind of an erythritol cooling effect but nothing that we haven't seen anywhere else so that's okay, yeah, it's okay. Mm -hmm. well, mm. i enjoy it Okay, next, something that a lot of people have been saying that they like, the uh, peppermint ice chips. So these are supposed to be like keto peppermints, like, and we don't have those on the keto diet, you know? Just like a, like a breath mint sort of thing. So mm -hmm. a lot of people were excited to see these. I've never tried them yes. before. A, it smells so pepperminty. B, I was not expecting it to not have any red color at all. So, like, yeah, I mean, this looks like ice. No wonder they say ice chips because... Is that what it says? Yeah, these wow. are, yeah. 
These are ice chips candy, sweetened with xylitol, real peppermint. Okay. Are we ready? Uh huh. I jumped the gun. Mm. You noticed. <laughs> Excuse me. Mmm. I love that. Okay, first of all, it causes me a little bit of anxiety that it's just all crunched up and they're, they're not uniform in size. That's um, anxiety. Mm hmm. But. And they're sharp. Like, I'm stabbing myself in the roof of my mouth. I don't do that. Yes, oh, I enjoy those. That's good. That's very good. That's a good palate cleanser. It is. Thank you. I, one, I can't taste nothing but peppermint. Number one, I'd buy those at a reasonably Yeah, price. I was just going to say, depending on the price, mm -hmm. I would definitely purchase those. Yes. Yeah. I These are say, good. I would say one, too, if they're, if they're competitive. Yeah. This is, a, this is a one for me. I, I've never tasted anything like this. Just keep them on away keto. from your animals. Oh my exactly, with the xylitol. Mm hmm. hmm. <laughs> These are good. Tier one for me. Yeah, all of yep, I think we all said one. Yay. Yay. That was great. <laughs> okay, next we are going to have this Fresh Green. I think that's the name of the company. Full Green. Sorry about oh, that. Yeah, Full Green Collie Rice. So this I thought was such an interesting concept. Thank you, Richard. This I thought was such an interesting concept of like, you know, you see those Uncle Bins, mm -hmm. those Zatarans, if you will, just microwave in a pouch rice. Mm -hmm. So this is microwave in a pouch collie rice. This particular Yay. flavor is with tomatoes, garlic, and herbs. So I heated this in the microwave for two and a half minutes. It's very hot. Like, so everyone take a spoon. Oh my gosh, it is very, yeah, I, I see the steam, okay. Very hot. Uh, oh my god. Uh, oh, oh my god, that is my ear. Okay, take a take. Okay, but like yeah, lots of lots of blows because lots of blows. Why are you rocking it, Mom? You don't oh. need to rock it. Oh, sorry. Oh Dad, Richard just went for it. Okay. Oh, I thought we were gonna lose it. Right off the bat needs salt. Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm just gonna say that. Needs it. Tastes like nothing salt. because it needs salt. It needs a lot of salt. And you know, I intentionally did not put salt exactly. on it because it was like, you want to taste yeah, how exactly. it would taste, but that flavoring, yes. like, I honestly don't taste garlic. I, I, I barely taste the tomato, but boy, I that taste needs the salt. Lack of salt. Yeah, I mean, that, <laughs> that needs salt. I but, mean, I do taste the tomato. But though. with salt, that's a great side dish. I mean, the texture is oh, okay. Yeah. It's it's kind of smooth yeah. and mushy, but if you don't really mind that, especially. I would definitely doctor it up yeah. on the stove top or something. Yeah, like else. especially if you didn't have to put a lot of effort into it for just popping yeah. this in the microwave. If you yeah. add some salt to this for 80 calories and six total carbs for oh. that whole pouch, I mean, oh, yeah, that's clearly two bad. serving. Yeah. 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 I, would, like, I would say put like a, a, a teaspoon of butter in there as well. Or yeah, like, like ooh, yeah. that's see, salt, there you go. Butter. Maybe oh, some sour like, cream. Ooh. Like now we're just turning it into something. But once again, you have to touch it on. Yeah, but once again, with just being oh, yeah. so easy and convenient, just buying it without that's worrying. a great, yeah. That's definitely a side dish. Right yeah, there that's a anything. that's a two or three. Yeah, that is you know, a two. I like it. yeah, definitely don't mind I would that at all. Say two. Hmm, look that's at that. Two. Even though it needs salt, it's a two with salt. Yes. Look at that. <laughs> okay, the next thing we are trying is this Sweet Logic confetti cake. Mm. Ooh, dessert. Yeah, so I've had the the red velvet and I thought it was delicious. Uh, everyone, we're reusing our spoons here. So, yes. uh, so this is just a confetti birthday cake type. Just add water. I added the the butter and the egg in order to make the real mug cake. Nice. I'm expecting sprinkles. I'm expecting like to to get my confetti cake real. Get your mug cake yeah. On. yeah. So yeah, this is what it looks like inside the mug. Just it very looks like regular at, the mug. at best. Yes, thank you, oh, Richard. Right, so. Um, okay, going in. Uh, I, I definitely uh, like the consistency. It it's like very, cake. very mm -hmm. cakey. Definitely also, not. lots of steam. Very Watch out. Spongy. It's hot. Yeah, it's very spongy. Okay. Here we go. Mm. Are we eating it? Yeah. Ready? Huh. It's like it's like a hot cupcake. Yeah. I really like yeah. that. Hot cupcake. Confetti. Yes, that was okay. very, very nice. I'll be dang. I mean, yeah, that's good. Let me be sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that is really good. I mean, you know, I don't really see a lot of sprinkles in there, but like as a, as a, like a white cake, you know, like yeah. this is a, this is a Pillsbury, add some eggs and put it in, you know, the oven and comes out. Yes. This is what it tastes yes. like. I mean, I enjoy that's it. delicious. Like that's a, that's a very, tier one for good. me. Who is this again? Sweet Logic, formerly 
Thank you. Mm -hmm. Primal noms. Yes. Oh, that's them? Yeah. I will never. Yes. It's mm -hmm. a solid two for me. Yes. Yeah. Solid. I mean, this, is, this is like a one. Oh, I was going to say, I'll take a one on that. Yeah. Yes. I'd buy these. Not a, not a sweet lover. Especially if they really came good. in like a variety pack right, where yeah, I could get a multiple. Yeah. That's delicious. Mm -hmm. Okay, sweet logic. Yes. Next, we have these California Keto K Bites Cinnamon Pecan Energy Bites. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Nobody leaned in, but that's okay. I made them earlier today, and this is what they look like. They kind of almost look like meatballs. No, that's what I was <laughs> if you just look at them and look away, no, you know. when you mix them with the cali, cali rice with yeah. them. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I will say yeah, oh these my. were easy to make. Okay. Like all you have to do is add four tablespoons of nut butter and then like water in order to get the consistency that you wanted. Mm -hmm. I could very easily tell when I was supposed to stop adding in water and be like, oh, these oh. are the Just right consistency, yeah, wow, to form into nice. balls, you know? So um everyone take a take a energy bite. Yeah, give me a California keto ball. Yeah, exactly. Yes. We want a, we want a keto ball. Do the whole thing? Or? No. No, I'm not. Mm. I mean, in my opinion, it tastes like cinnamon. almond flour cinnamon. and cinnamon. I do yeah, taste yeah. the pecan. Mm. I mean, this isn't bad. Not bad. I'm not against it. No. Yeah. I give it a tier three only because it's not grab and go. Like, oh. you know, like it's not a bar that I can just grab. I'd have to actually put in some effort to actually do this. The that taste of it is not bad, mm -hmm. but the fact that I'd have to like do stuff in order to prepare it makes it a three for me. Dirty up is all I'm saying. Um, I'd also, maybe I'd be interested to see if they had other flavors too, you know? I mean, well, it definitely tastes else? like cinnamon and pecan, mm -hmm. but um, I just, it's it not, not my deal. It's a two for me. <laughs> Finally, oh. we are trying keto chow, chocolate oh keto chow. Lean in for the and love of God. That's all hope. So yeah, this is just chocolate keto chow. This is the ultra low carb meal replacement shake mix for nutritional ketosis. So I, I know it, it, that's a lot. So I actually made this keto chow yesterday because you know, everyone Science. says, yeah, everyone says that the best thing to do is to make it a day in advance. So I mixed four ounces of heavy whipping cream. Mm -hmm. Then I poured in the chocolate keto mm -hmm. chow and then I poured in 14 more ounces of warmish water, okay. shook it up real, real good. Yeah, you did. You right. And then I stuck it in the refrigerator like overnight and every so often, you know, whenever I open the refrigerator, like get some water, get mm -hmm. something else, I just give it another shake just cause, you know, I can say that when I open this packet, it smells, oh, just like chocolate milk. Even, oh. Oh, even still. Chocolate milk on the ground. Oh, yes, it does. Like Nesquik. Yeah, I mean, it no, just tastes it like does. chocolate milk. Okay, oh, so now. Gracious. I know, so we're going to see. Come on. So that's basically what it is. It's just Nesquik. Let's see how it pours. Oh, my gosh. It's so thick. Excuse me, this yes. is all I get. I mean, we're just taking a shot. Well, okay. I mean, I mean it, is, it is thick, thick. Definitely thick. coats the, you know, the container. Oh, my gosh. Mm -hmm. I mean, oh, my God. That is. That is viscous, ladies oh and gentlemen. Gosh. Excuse me? Wow, that is very thick and satisfying. Yes, it is. That's what she said. You're right. Oh my gosh, see okay. where you get it from now. See, look at that. I mean, look how it coats the... Look, the, look at the viscousness. Yeah, yes. okay. That's what Viscosity. She said. That's what she said. Richard, if not... <laughs> it's literally what she said. That's what I was saying. <laughs> okay, yes, viscosity. Let's go. <laughs> Cheers. 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 Just got alcohol in it. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh, and it's rich and thick and chocolate, but you can drink it slow. I mean, it's old. What is that? What was the old commercial? <laughs> there is alcohol in this thing. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening over there? I mean, it was. Can I have some of yours? 1980s commercials. Wow. I'll have what she's Wait. having. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it was okay. Exactly. After all that, basically, that is oh delicious. The <laughs> texture or like the smoothness, amazing. Like the thick, it really does kind of feel like a milkshake. Mm -hmm. And I mean, look how much more is left. This would definitely be really filling. Is that one serving? Yeah, this is one serving. Shut the this is door. one meal replacement. You know, wow. so okay. yeah. And for that, it, it look at Richard. Okay. And for that, it is 535 calories. 
Yeah, so that's 500 calories for the way that I made it. 12 total carbs, uh -oh. six uh, are fiber. And so it says it's around like five net carbs. So five net carbs for that. But this is like a third of your daily calories, basically. Mm -hmm. That Damn, would definitely be nice. a third of my daily calories. Like that would be substantial enough to be a third of the yeah, daily yeah. calories. That could be my breakfast. Yeah, exactly. I can, I can yeah, no take more. some more of that. I mean, if I must. Yeah, if you have to. I mean, I mean, that's just really good. I mean, yeah, I it's agree. okay. It's delicious. It's a okay, this is at, shake. This is at uh, tier one. I can definitely see how people make ice cream out of this. I mean, this is basically ice cream as is. Like, put that in the freezer. I know. That's really good. Mm -hmm. That's tier like one or two. Like, depending on yeah. how much it costs, no, I haven't really so. checked. Yes, but that, but the flavor. I mean, that's I would, that's I would delicious. Put it in tier one, depending mm -hmm. on pricing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would definitely go out and buy it. Okay. That's good. Overall, I really enjoyed this keto box. There mm -hmm. were some things that I already you know knew that i was gonna like some things i never had before um you know i i liked the the savory options and i liked the things that you had to kind of make overnight you know i liked that it wasn't just like bar 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 exactly. bar you know so oh, i really course. did enjoy that. that and do you know who else is going to enjoy this the person that wins the giveaway who is that? Oh, and that God. person is oh my gosh oh my try God. The Keto Chow, oh. it is delicious. Yes, try it. We liked it a little bit. Yeah, just a, a smidgen. Mm, so yeah. if you did not win, super sorry, but don't worry, you can get 20% off your first Keto box by using the code WATCHAUTUMNKETO. I'll put the link in the description box below. Overall, I am looking forward to receiving this monthly and trying all the new yes. Keto snacks that Let it delivers go. to me. Comment down below, have you gotten the keto box? Did you get this keto box? What item did you like out of it the most? Or what item do you think that you would like to try the most? Yeah, we had some really good stuff. The peppermints. Yeah. Oh my God, those ice chips. chips. Now that was the winner yes. for me. Absolutely. Because I've never seen anything like that in my nearly three years on the diet. Humble bread. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly full days of eating, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate and keto box unboxings, the occasional product review and recipe. You can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, and Patreon at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks, and we'll see you next month. Bye. Bye. Uh-oh, she's trying to get all the way. Oh, Richard. Oh, got a burp. Everybody, when I mm. when I put something toward the camera, lean in and hide your face. Just let that be your default, okay? What? Christina, I said lean in. Thank you. I mean. Yeah. Oh, I, I hid my face. Okay. I don't have the synchronized dancing down. <laughs> dancing? <laughs> yes, I can't. <laughs> Especially now I'm learning how to do this now. Oh, no. oh, oh my gosh. Hey. Hey. On this. Default. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. Mm. Okay. Yes, I'm turning there with some, I'm I'm turning some salt oh on it. It's god. probably wonderful. Y'all can have all these balls.